That's difficult. It's hard to vlog. You think we'll ever be pros at this or no? Hopefully by the end of 26 days we'll be pros. You will think things are going to be better. It'll probably come together well. <laughs> it probably really will. When you put I it all together so. and it's just clips. I'm a little nervous about it. Today is Friday, which means we get to leave on a road trip tomorrow. I'm really, really excited. Um, it also means today we've got a lot of stuff to do. So we still gotta do some packing. We've gotta load up the car, run a few errands. First, I've gotta go to work for a few hours. Um, I think I might go for a little run too. All right, so I'm on the way to work this morning. And honestly, I am feeling uh, a little uncomfortable so far with the whole vlogging thing. I don't feel super comfortable talking <laughs> to a camera. So, um, still kind of getting used to that, adjusting to it. So I just made it to work and I guess I just want to take a second and talk about why it is um, I wanted to make this vlog. And the main reason I want to make this vlog is just for something that me and Leslie can look back and we can watch back. Um, later and kind of remember our trip, remember some of the things that we did that maybe um, we might forget. I made one video before. So I, I made a video with my sister of us taking our dog, Millie, to the park. And so it wasn't really anything special. But the video kind of became special because not long after we made it, Millie actually passed away. So it was really, really sad. Um, she passed away, but we still have that video. And so all of a sudden the video that was kind of just silly and dumb became like this special thing. It's like uh, one of the one of the things we have left of her. And so that's kind of a sad way to start the, the, the vlog, but um, it's kind of what, what influenced me, I guess. We're gonna vlog for like 25 days. I've never vlogged before, so I'm gonna just jump in and I'm gonna vlog every day on our road trip. And other reason for this vlog is kind of just to give updates to my family and if any friends want to know what we're doing on our road trip, just give them updates and let them see what we're doing and and, and exploring and kind of share some of our adventures with them. All right, and now uh, I'm going to head into work for a few hours and then we'll get started on doing our last minute things for the trip. Work today so we can get to uh, those errands, sit back in the car, get ready for the road trip. I got me a coffee from the coffee shop. Vietnamese iced coffee, which is my favorite. So the plan for today is, I think we, we've got to, obviously we've got to finish packing. we got to load everything up in the car, get it ready for tomorrow so we can get out of here early and get going. Um, and then also, since our last day in New Orleans, not forever, but just for a couple of weeks, I think we're probably going to do a couple of our favorite um, things. Definitely probably get beignets. What? what do you want to say? I don't want to say anything. All right, we're headed out. We've got to deliver a package to the post office. We've got to take our key to the Rosses so that they can hold on to it for us of our apartment. And then what are we going to do after that, Leslie? We're going to go eat some beignets. All right. This is awkward. That's what I'm saying is we got to get used to it playing and recording it, so let's just let it play. I don't just know talk what as to do normal. when you're talking. Just talk as normal. I don't know what to do when you're talking. I didn't talk normal. Well, on your phone, look at the... No, you did talk normal. I'm just saying if we can talk normal in front of the camera, it would be more natural. I just don't know what to do when you're talking. Play on your phone or look outside or smile or... All right, we made it to the city park, so we're going to get us some beignets. I don't know what Leslie's laughing about. But, you know. <laughs> Where does it rank on your list of favorite snacks? That's a better question. Probably like top two. What What else is in the top two? I don't know. 
asked me on the spot, I couldn't answer. <laughs> All right, great answer. Thank you. <laughs> fanny pack because she said it made me look too much like a tourist and we live here so I had to leave it in the car unfortunately but I'm gonna get a lot of use out of it this uh, this road trip what you don't like this table what? What's wrong with it? It's just missing one slab. It's missing half the table. You need to get in the shop. Why, right, we found us a new spot. Get our big knees. How are they? Very good. All right, we're back home, we finished packing, and so now we're ready to start loading up the car. Our living room right now looks like this. And so we're, uh, we're gonna get all the stuff, we're gonna load it up in the car, and then we'll be ready to go tomorrow. Everything's made it down from the third floor. Leslie, how do you feel about that? Glad it's done. So it's mostly packed. It's very, very tight. Uh, uh, <laughs> there's a whole lot of stuff packed in this car. Um, Leslie, do you think this is gonna work? I don't know. <laughs> well, we'll see. We might have to rearrange a few things. Um, but for right now, this is what we're going with. All right, so this is the route that we're going to be taking on our road trip out west. So obviously we're going to start in New Orleans, uh, here where we live. Um, but from New Orleans, we're going to start by heading out west. We're going to go to Fort Worth, Texas, which is where my cousin um, and his wife, Jenna, live. They're going to let us spend the night with them. Um, and then from there, we're going to go to... Amarillo, Texas. Um, we're going to eat at the Big Texan there. 
and then we're headed to Denver for a couple of nights. We're gonna go to Rocky Mountain National Park and just get to explore the city some. And then from Denver, we're gonna head up north. We're gonna go to uh, Rapid City, South Dakota, where we're gonna see Mount Rushmore. We're gonna go across Wyoming. We're gonna stop in Gray Bull, um, where there's a dinosaur track site. And then we're headed to Yellowstone. We're just gonna get to see all of the Yellowstone sites and go hiking. Um, that'll be a lot of fun. And then we're gonna spend a night in Salt Lake City and tour Temple Square before we go to Moab, where we get to see Arches National Park and Canyonlands National Park. And then from Moab, we go to Bryce Canyon. Uh, in Bryce Canyon, um, we get to stay actually in a teepee. Which is my favorite part. It's gonna be super cool. And then from Bryce Canyon, we're gonna go to Zion National Park. Um, in Zion National Park, obviously we're just gonna do hiking. We're gonna see the sites around there and then from there, we're going to Las Vegas and we're gonna get to explore the strip and ride the high roller and go to the Neon Museum, which will be a lot of fun. And then we're going to the Grand Canyon where we'll be able to hike and see the Grand Canyon and all that it has to offer. And then from there, we're gonna go across to uh, Mesa Verde. Um, we're gonna see the cliff dwellings there um, before we head to Santa Fe, New Mexico. Um, in Santa Fe, we're going to kind of try to see some local art and things like that. And then we're going to head to Abilene, Texas, but on the way we're going to stop in Roswell and we're going to get to see all of the alien and UFO stuff there. And then in Abilene, it'll be the 4th of July, so we're going to watch their fireworks. Then we're going to go to uh, Waco where we're going to see Magnolia Farms and things like that, whatever Magnolia things there are there. Um, then we're going to go to Galveston. We're going to spend a day at the beach. Um, and finally, we're going to head back to New Orleans. We'll be back home um, after our road trip. Home sweet home. All right, so we're about to try to repack a little bit of this stuff because the car is way too full right now. Um, we'll let you know how it goes. All right, so we repacked some things in the car. It's a little bit better. We got rid of a few things. You can kind of see out of the back now, which is good. Got rid of a few things, rearranged a few things. So we're looking good. favorite restaurants district uh, we're gonna miss it we're not gonna be able to have it for a long time so we had to get it one last time before we leave Leslie, how are you feeling about it? Feeling good. A little nervous. All right. A little tired. Yeah. All right. Well, we're super excited. We're going on a road trip.